This video is brought to you by DICE, the global entertainment content marketplace. Welcome back to our Fantastic Five series. Today, we are going to explore five Christmas titles from our wide content catalogue. So, if you're a buyer and wish to acquire any of these titles, or you're a seller looking to get your content out to a global audience, you can get in touch with us through our website, connect.digital, or you can email us at dicesales at connectdigital.com. Without further ado, let's get into our top five Christmas titles for this month. Just in time for Christmas, this heartwarming tale begins with two guardian angels, Dick Van Dyke and Angela Lansbury, who are sent to help two orphan children, Annabelle and Emily. During the early 1900s, tragedy strikes Annabelle's happy life when she is left to the care of her mother's cruel stepsister, Mrs. Wentworth, Katie McGrath, who sends her to work at the mill, where she is destined to become a mill girl. Annabelle escapes and lives on the streets alone and brokenhearted, but with a little help from our guardian angel, Dick Van Dyke, Annabelle finds a new home and discovers happiness once again. Now years later, during the Great Depression, a young orphan, Emily, is rescued from the streets and given temporary shelter at Belford Hills Hospital. Just when Emily's future seems dim, she is visited by an angel named Rose, Angela Lansbury, who has come to help Emily fulfill her wish to find a family. On Christmas Eve, through the workings of these two angels, Annabelle and Emily's stories are woven together into a triumphant and inspiring ending, and each one rediscovers that even in times of darkness, magic and miracles do exist if you simply remember to believe. We each have a guardian angel that is with us from the moment we're born till the day we die. Believe, Annabelle, and take heart, you're never alone. Promise me, you'll remember what I have said. Santa's elves have gone on strike because they are tired of ungrateful and self-centered kids. In desperation, Santa brings six mischievous teens from the local mall to help. After several unsuccessful attempts to escape, including stealing Santa's sleigh, Santa sends them to watch the naughty slash nice videos, where they have to vote on the kids' behavior. It all seems fun until they realize that they may not have been as nice as they originally thought. Kidnapping a sleeping elf, they have one last chance to force Santa into sending them home. Santa's boot camp is a fun, festive treat for kids of all ages. What the you? You old twerp. You have been handpicked by me to save Christmas. You'll get started with the basics. Shoveling reindeer poop. This holiday season. Dude, this could be fun. You think this would be fun? Six teenagers will go to boot camp. Welcome to boot camp. This version of A Christmas Carol aims to capture the essence of the festive spirit through a raw, live performance. Through the eyes of Martin Prest, we see Dickens' timeless festive tale of redemption come back to life. Prest executed this performance very well, playing over 20 characters alone in a single set. This rendition of the classic Christmas tale is a must-see for those that want to see the story performed in the way Dickens did himself, one man on one stage. Christmas, Uncle Humbug. You will be haunted by three spirits. Why show me this in my past all over? A Merry Christmas to everybody. God bless us, everyone. After losing her parents in a car accident, Elle, a career-driven investment banker, has given up on love and Christmas. That is, until she meets Wesley, a former NBA player and CEO of a small marketing firm. Wesley invites Elle to his hometown in South Carolina. With hesitation, she accepts and is thrown into a loop where she falls in love and finds the spirit of Christmas again. Christmas in Carolina is a sweet movie where we follow a heartbroken individual who has lost so much find their way back to happiness again. You don't need to interfere. You just have to learn how to enjoy life. <laughs> Seeing you and your family together makes me wish I had that in my life. Now.
Kelly Brooks is an elementary school teacher who has given up on love. This was until her childhood friend, Andrew, a professional baseball player, returns home and invites Kelly to spend Christmas with his family in Myrtle Beach. Reluctantly, Kelly agrees as she remembers how it ended between them years ago, but with a little nudge from a good friend, she realizes she still has feelings for Andrew and plans to tell him at the Christmas party. Full of heartwarming romance centered around the Christmas spirit, Another Christmas is the perfect movie to add to the seasonal watch list. You okay? What's up? It's Kelly, man. I can't sleep, can't work, can't <laughs> nothing. Man. She got it. <laughs> Whoa, you got it, you got it, man. <laughs> man, look, if I could do it all over again with her, I would. Mm -hmm. uh, hey. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. What do you think of our choices? Let us know down in the comments below. As always, you can get in touch with us through our website, connect.digital, or you can email us at dicesales at connectdigital.com for business inquiries. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. Have a great day.